Namaskar students. Today we are going to discuss about 15th October current affairs. So let me start with the last of GK question. Where is Limber Wildlife Sanctuary situated Jammu and Kashmir? Where is Nandini Wildlife Sanctuary situated Jammu and Kashmir? Where is Bamboo Island Wildlife Sanctuary and Peacock Island Wildlife Sanctuary situated Andaman and Nicobar Island? Where is Nambur Wildlife Sanctuary and Amsham Wildlife Sanctuary situated Azam? Where is Kaimur Wildlife Sanctuary along with Valmigi Wildlife Sanctuary situated Bigar? The tribes in Meghalaya are Chakma, Hajong, Lakar, Pawai, Rabba and Nigir. Dondo Kesho Karve received Bharat Ratna in 1958. Article 43 explained about Gram Sabha and Article 243b explained about Panjayat. We take concurrent list, language of the preamble, joint sitting of the two houses, freedom of trade and commerce from Australia. The famous Santur musical exponent were Shikumar Sharma, Tarun Bhattacharya, Bhajan Sopoi. Kanto is the highest peak of Arunachal Pradesh. 20 point program, minimum needs program was established in 1975 in 5th fire plan. The 5th fire plan was very successful where the target we achieved 4.8 percentage and we fixed 4.4 percentage. The 5th fire plan extended on 1974 to 1978, it was not complete the fifth year because the Moraji Desai government cancelled this cancelled this fifth fire plan. Right to freedom explained in Article 19 to 22. Guru Vidyaranya wrote a book titled Raja Kala Nirnia. Who has been appointed as the chairman of SBA, Dinesh Kara? Who has been awarded Nobel Prize 2023 in Economic Sciences, Claudia Golding? Which country launched Operation Iron Swords, Israel? Who wrote the book, The Book of My Life, Vivek Agni Gotri? Which armed force organized Excise Chakravar, Indian Navy? Who was appointed as the Chairman of Association of Mutual Funds in India? Navneet Munot. Navneet Munot. And the Association of Mutual Funds in India was established in 1995. NHCA was established in 1988. ONGC was established in 1956. ISRO was established in 1969. Vinay Kumar Saxena is the Lieutenant Governor of Delhi. Subhash Yardhan Mudra is the Chairman of BAC Limited. Nidhi Chibar is the chairman of CBSC. Raju Kumar is the chief election commissioner of India. Sanju Kapoor is the director general of Indian Air Force. B.S. Raju is the vice chief of Indian Army. Vijay Sampla is the chairman of National Commission for SC. Who has been honored with Dutch Spinoza Prize 2023? So she received means Joita Gupta received. Dutch Spinoza Prize for Climate Change Research. For Climate Change Research. Naina Dakad received Sensin Norge Adventure Award in Land Adventure category. Shubham Dhananjay Vanmali received Sensin Norge Adventure Award in Water Adventure category. Imayam Annamale received Kuwembu National Award. Ravi Kumar Sagar received Dr. Abdul Kalam Seva Puraskar. 14th Dalai Lama means Tenzin Gyatso received Gandhi Mandela Award 2022. Uma Sharma received Sumitra Charamram Award 2022. Who created a new national record in 100 meter sprint? It is not 1000 meter, it is 100 meter sprint. The person is Maniganda H. Hoblidar. Maniganda H. Hoblidar create a new national record in 100 meter sprint and he achieved this 100 meter sprint in 10.23 second. He surpassed the record of Amiya Kumar Malik. Amiya Kumar Malik of 10.26 second. Parul Choudhury broke the national record of Surya Loganadan in women's 3000 meter. 
Elvis Al Hazareka is the oldest Indian to swim across the Nath Channel. Jyoti Araji broke national record in 100 meter hurdles. Shaga Tarora broke national record in women's 50 meter breaststroke. Jasmin Aldrin broke national record of Sri Shankar in men's long jump and Jasmin Aldrin jumped 8.42 meter. Sampana Ramesh Shailar is the fastest Indian to swim across Park Street. Pravin Chitra will create a national record in triple jump and he jumped 7.37 meter. Parul Choudhury also created a national record in 3000 meter steeple chase. Which day is observed as Indian Air Force Day? Every year we observed October 8 as Indian Air Force Day. Indian Air Force Day was established in 1932 on October 8th. So this year we celebrated 91st Air Force Day. August 23rd National Space Day. September 21 World Alzheimer Day International Day of Peace. 4th Sunday of September World Rivers Day. Last Thursday of September World Maritime Day. 1st Monday of October World Habitat Day. October 1st International Day of Older Persons. October 7th World Cotton Day. The state government launched Lake Ladgi scheme. So it was launched by Maharashtra state government. So the meaning of Lake Ladgi scheme is dear daughter. Dear daughter. So the state government wants to provide a financial assistance for of, of, of rupees 1 lakh for the daughter of or the for the daughter of the poor family. and talking about maharashtra the first state in india to launch a scheme to offer personal loans jithwala for for prisoners is eravada jail in maharashtra mumbai is recognized as 2021 tree city of the world and maharashtra state renamed aurangabad as sambhaji nagar ahmednagar district as agilya holkar and osmanabad as dharashiv recently dagi gandhi festival of maharashtra get sports status The first state in India to pass the Lokayita Bill. Maharashtra state government launched Vande Mataram initiative, Sachin Appaliya Dari initiative, and Saloka Yojana, Namo Shetkari Maga Sanmam Yojana, and launched a video call facility for foreign national prisoners. Maharashtra economy will become a trillion dollar in 2028. The state to host 37th edition of National Games 2023, and the state is Goa. And the state is Goa. So last year it was conducted by Gujarat. The national games was formerly known as Indian Olympic Games. It was launched in 1924. Gujarat hosted International Kite Festival and 30th National Children's Science Congress 2023. Kolkata hosted 23rd India International Sea Food. Tamil Nadu hosted Wind Energy. Karnataka hosted Aero India, Mumbai hosted Technotex and 14th edition of World Space Congress. Bhopal hosted 8th India International Science Festival and Science Literature Festival Vigyanika. Karnataka hosted 4th International Trade Fair of Millets and Organic Products. Gujarat to host 69th edition of Film Fair Awards in 